In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to download and install any version of the Microsoft .NET framework for your Windows 10 operating system PC. Hello my friend, my name is Kenneth Brown. Welcome to channel Signatech and how are we doing today? I hope fantastic. Well, if you are not doing fantastic, I probably understand the reason why. So let's make this simple, quick and easy so that you go away with a big smile on your face. So installing any version of the .NET framework is super easy to do, but the only problem is you need to get that downloaded from a clean website. What I mean by that is normally when you want to download .NET to your computer system, you need to go to the the Microsoft website, of course, the official website and get it downloaded from there, uh, depending on your operating system. Okay, but sometimes what happens is that you don't find that version out there. So in such cases, what you need to do and after you find the version you need to download, how you could install it to your computer system is going to be the video for today precisely. Okay, so the first thing to do is get onto Microsoft.com. Okay, this is going to be uh, your first attempt to download the .NET version you need for your PC. Okay, so it's going to be Microsoft.com. Once you type in Microsoft, once you type in Microsoft.com, you get onto the official website for uh, you know Microsoft softwares, of course, right? So if you want to search for .NET, it's very simple. Click on the search button, and you get a pop up like this. Type in .NET. Okay. Once you do that, you're going to be directed to this page. You scroll down, and you could see here whatever versions are available for you to download. Okay, if you want to download .NET Framework 3.5, you could click on this link, you get an option to download. You want to download 4.0, this is here you click on this link you get an option to download you want to download dotnet framework 2.0 you click on this link you get a link to download dotnet to your computer system now sometimes what happens is that specific applications would need a specific version of dotnet so say supposing you need dotnet 6.0.1 it's not available out here. Even if you do a search out here, you're not going to get it. So what you could do is in such cases, you could do a direct search on Google or Bing. All right, I prefer using Bing because uh, this is related to Microsoft. So I'm just going to type in here, download.net 6.0.1. Okay, so once you do that, you could do a search, and once you do a search, you're gonna get suggestions from Bing. Of course, the first two or three are the legit websites to download the softwares without any malware or without any viruses. Okay, so you click on the first link, always suggested, and you get directed to this page on which you could download the specific version you're looking for, 6.0.1. And see, supposing you have a 64-bit Windows 10 operating system, you click on this link to download the installer, okay? Now, once you click on that link, you could see here that the installer is being downloaded, all right? And once this gets downloaded, I will show you how to install this to your computer system the proper way. So you could see here that the installer for .NET 6.0.1 is downloaded to your computer system. The next thing to do is open the file. So once you click on open file or uh, you get to your downloads folder and click on the installer icon, you're going to get a pop up like this, which is going to tell you that it is going to install .NET 6.0.1. Okay, 64 bit for Windows 10, right? So you click on install. And once you do that, you get a pop up like this, click on yes. And the next thing is you have to sit back, relax and wait for a few minutes or a few seconds and you see that this is being installed to your computer system. So I'll be back after this is installed, okay? So as you can see, .NET 6.0.1 has been installed on your uh, Windows desktop on a Windows 10 operating system. Now you could close this and you could use whatever apps that run on this specific version of .NET. So it's not just this version, whatever version of .NET framework you are looking for, for your Windows operating system, you could actually do a search, first of all, on Microsoft com the way I showed you in my video for today. If that doesn't work, you could do a Bing search and you get all the legit websites that allow you to download .NET to your computer system. So I hope this information was useful and you got some value out of my video for today. If you did, please give my video a thumbs up, post a nice little comment and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. 
So this is it for today. Until my next one. Adios. Take care.